Don't forget this is lube. And man, I am in a jubilant mood. Um, just thought I would do the my pickups from the last Supreme Week right here. You can see um, about half of it, and then we'll find out what's in the box. Um, oh, sorry, this mess on the floor. We got them. Um, I think I'm finally gonna hang my Supreme Lantern. So I'll be doing that later, and then wow, well, Friday. Um, Hopefully it'll go, it does not get canceled, but I managed to check out the uh, Nike Air Force One restock. So almost caught the resale because I thought it was only going to last a season, but here we are. Picked it up. Um, this is my one of my Supreme racks, regular racks. If you want to get a sneak peek at my drips, these these are the cheat codes right here. These are the cheat codes. All right, so I'll do the first piece. I showed this in my last video. Check that one out. Um, but this is the Pat McGrath lipstick. I mean, as far as lipstick goes, I'm not a connoisseur, but uh, it's got a nice em uh, embossing there. Shake her out. And I guess we can do a taste test. Should I sample? No, I'm not sure if I'm going to keep this or not. Um, so I don't want to get a CDC complaint or whatever. Uh, pop the top. And let this, you know. So weird that everyone just kind of knows how to open lipstick, but I've never used it. Is that just because it's like chapstick? Yeah, probably. Pretty tasty. Uh, but no, this is, I mean, fairly nice lipstick. It is a little darker than like the color looks. I'm trying to get it right, but yeah, okay. So a little darker, but I believe the color is Supreme Red, obviously. So super nice packaging in case. Uh, I don't know a goddamn thing about Pat McGrath though, so. And then we have, we'll open the box. One-handed, of course. Uh, known for my camera work in such situations. And I am opening this just today, so this box has just been sitting here. That's, um, I don't think I'm gonna keep these unless seeing them in person really changes my mind. I still have the hole punch ones, which I really shouldn't have sat on for so long. Lost a sticker. So these are the register to vote stickers. Feel free to screenshot now, I suppose. They do say Supreme on them as well, so it's still cool to vote, I guess. Don't vote if you don't know what you're doing. Uh, these are gloves, more. They're still giving out prostate exam gloves, man. They must have had a truckload. I guess it's that time of year, huh? And we got one regular BOGO sticker as well, along with the vote sticker. And then we got the Supreme box, Supreme label on the box of a pair of Vans. And the rest comes fairly well, fairly well packaged. And we'll take a look at the shoes. So we got Supreme Vans. We're open her up. Okay, so this is a pair of old schools. The, probably the most popular model. Skate High is up there as well. So we'll pull out both, pa both, <laughs> both pairs, both shoes. And we'll take a peek ski. All right. Camera work, next level, right? So, uh, so we got the Supreme with the crisscross grid pattern there. Everything else pretty standard on the Vans. Um, except I don't think I've ever had a pro. So uh, the difference is probably, I believe the cushioning. And then we have another Supreme hit on the back. And it does say pro right there as well. So um, if we can take out the, oh yeah, this is um, feeling pretty succulent. The So the padding here is wild. This is very thick and cushiony. Super nice with purple hits on the inside. So it does have that red, I believe. Um, let me see. This is a pair of OG, extremely beat up old schools, but I think these look uh, way better, to be honest. I don't like shoes with black soles that much. Is it really, I think it really limits the amount of the colors, that, the color schemes that you can have. Small cut there because I ran out of storage, but. Uh, we are back. Of course, we made the storage. Had to delete all your mom's nudes. So, put these back and we'll get into the last item. And they do come with an extra set of white joints. And 
the Supreme Van Tam tag. Pretty cool, nice touch. So that's those. Not a huge fan, but if you're in the market for a all black shoe, definitely check that out. And then we've got the, almost forgot about this piece because I was resting everything on top of it. This is the Supreme folding chair. So I'm going to do a comfort test and I will let you know the results right now. So, oh, I think I just had a little accident there. Um, oh, excuse me. Sorry, I'm always ready uh, whenever needed. Um, so, yeah, the chair. Uh, this is like one of those chairs that was like, that you see and like, just give me, like, I, put, I sat in here and I was like teleported back in time to like sitting in an auditorium, like at school or um, whatever. This is like the exact same chair, you know, when you would like, you would see like, oh, I can carry so many chairs. You'd be like, oh, who wants to help clean up? And then you would carry as many goddamn chairs as you could because you were like, oh, like, you know, look at me, look at how many chairs I can carry. I'm in fifth grade. Basically, um, something like that. And so I immediately teleported here, but it was more, what the? Oh, oh God. Uh, but it's more like, you know, you'd be sitting like this, like with your knees, you'd be touching. And yeah, just, um, so yeah, but the chair, solid comfort, but it's literally the exact same chair that I'm sure you all have sat in. So, uh, that's pretty sweet. Um, wearing the Jesus is King shirt with, uh, Calabasas pants and just my house, my house slippers. Beep, beep. So let me know if you guys liked the video. If you picked them into anything up last week, pick up anything this week, or if you, uh, managed to cop the uh, Air Force One restock. All right, guys, so until the next video, toodles.